Good evening, everybody. Yeah, I'm, my name is Ben Lowen, and uh, uh, I have a I have a wife, Dorothy, and three wonderful children. And uh, yeah, I decided to go to that I was going to to Potters. I think about two days before I went, and at Potters, I decided I wanted to come to LCI. And uh, I'm thankful that it all worked out. During my, during my time at LCI, the Lord uh, showed me uh, s sins in my life that I needed to deal with, failures. And, uh, and I was able to ask him for forgiveness, and he forgave me. And he healed me, and I am so thankful of that. And that happened in the first week. Um, he also showed me that I should be more loving to my family, and with his help, I'm going to I'm going to do that. My time at LCI has been a, an experience. The Lord pouring Himself into me through numerous teaching. Um, it is truly wonderful when the Lord awakens in me a hunger for his word. The, the spirit explodes in revelation inside as, as I listen to his word, as, as one speaker explained it. Um, one experience was really awesome was when they uh, laid hands and prayed for us to uh, receive the baptism of the Holy Spirit. The, the Lord spoke to me in, in a very powerful way and uh, revealed many things as, a, as God's word was being preached. I want you to know that I have chosen to walk in the Lord's freedom, the freedom that the Lord has given me at LCI. I really enjoy the teachings of Jack Frost and the Father's Embrace, uh, especially uh, when he spoke about being broken before the Lord. It is great when you, when you humble yourselves and, and become open and transparent and let the Lord bless others through you. I was also blessed by uh, John Bevere's teaching on breaking the spirit of intimidation. He says, intimidation paralyzes us in the spirit realm. He said, if you want the word of the Lord to be hot, you got to preach the full gospel, not just sections that, are, that appeal to the liking of some people. Also, Robert Morris says, Satan can't hurt you. If he, could kill you, if he could kill you, he would already have. The way he can hurt you is to get you to harm yourself by speaking words of death. Mark 12, 33 to 37 says, Out of the abundance of the heart a man speaks. By words you are justified, and by your words you are condemned. I choose to speak words of life. And in, in closing, I just want to say that I really enjoyed the few weeks that I spent with the, the brothers and sisters here at uh, LCI. The presence of God was very strong, and, and just receiving God's love and, and the prayer and, and uh, all the sharing. Numerous times uh, I had hands laid on me, and, and they prayed for me. And I just, I'm just so thankful for what I gained. I want to thank Rich and Rachel and Dave and Dupe and uh, Kenrick and Mirta for all the hard work that they did for us. It was really amazing. Thank you very much. God bless you.